Hi folks, this is Jay. Hope you're okay today. It's good to see you. I'm just sharing with you today, to all the young people out there, and to anybody else who's listening. Uh, <coughs> I've been a, an observer of atheism for a couple of years. Um, and nearly every day I've been watching what they do and examining them on YouTube, their websites, and I've been also reading their main textbooks that they have, uh, etc. One of the things that's recently just come out is um, they're doing a questionnaire where uh, the atheist uh, YouTubers who make, who make videos, they, they will talk about their atheism and these questions are, are designed to people share their atheism. Now, it all seems quite innocent really, these atheists just telling their stories about how they became atheists, but with atheists nothing's ever as straightforward as that, nothing is ever as simple as that. What do I mean? Well, <clears throat> the last few years, the last five, or maybe a little bit longer, uh, well yeah, about ten years, um, there's been a, a growing missionary atheism uh, and basically uh, atheists are out to convert you to atheism okay so they have an agenda so all I'm saying is in this sort of sort of revival of atheism that's going around the West at the moment uh, it's been an ongoing thing for about 10 years uh, it's a missionary kind of atheism uh, they're using every tactic they can do it by defaming Christianity, uh, telling lies about Christianity, uh, telling lies about Christian leaders. Um, uh, they do that and then on the other side they'll do these nice cozy little stories that they're doing at the moment. All I'm saying to you is just be aware of these missionary atheists. They might be at your school, your college, they claim to know a bit about religion, but they're not very knowledgeable, really. Um, but if you haven't read your Bible much, when they quote a few Bible texts, you might be taken aback. Okay? Um, they say they don't take advantage of people, but the, but these missionary atheists, it's touchy, touchy, feely, feely. They'll tell you their stories, they'll befriend you. But what they want to do is they want to move you away from your beliefs. They want to move you into atheism okay so just be careful of these um, missionary atheists on YouTube and at your school and university not to say that uh, the bad people or anything like that but just to say that they are missionaries they say they're not but they are missionaries they are trying to out convert people to atheism uh, they're very very manipulative uh, just like the cults, the Mormons and the Jehovah's Witnesses, where um, they can pretend to be smiley, but they've got an agenda and they're trying to get you into a cult. So it's the same with this missionary atheism. It, it is like a cult. They have kind of cult leaders. They have kind of like cult indoctrination ideas. They don't think they're indoctrinated. They don't think they're in a cult. But they are. I've, I've talked to quite a lot of these atheists now, and... They are indoctrinated. They think they thought these think their ideas through themselves, but actually they've been indoctrinated. Uh, they can't get past this indoctrination that they've got in the brain. Once they get it in the brain, it's hard to get it out of them. Kind of like religion poisons everything. Um, kind of like uh, the God of the Bible is, is is bigoted, and they get these kind of ideas in the head, and they get these pet i pet texts and pet pet arguments that they pick up off this uh, this uh, atheism that's around today once they get it in their head they're completely uh, brainwashed and indoctrinated with it so be careful because once you get their ideas in your head it's hard to get it out and it will um, damage you uh, quite considerably they will try to tell you that they're trying to free your mind they're trying to open your mind but you'll find that these people are often not the most narrow-minded uh, kind of people that you'll ever meet. Okay, so be careful. What I would say to you is I'll leave a few sites for you to go to where you can study about Christianity, where you can study about atheism. 
and some key books that might help you. Uh, I'll put some atheist material on that you can look at as well as Christian. That's something you find the atheists never do on YouTube or on uh, uh, around on the websites. They never provide proper scholarship. That's another indication you've got to be very, very wary of these new missionary atheists. Okay? Thank you for listening and God bless you. This is Jay. Take care now.